Hello, hello. Hello, how are you? Hi, good evening. Good evening. Hey, it's a pleasure to have you here. Now with all this rain, come on, it's raining really hard. Heavy. <laughs> yeah, it's raining really, really, really hard. But it's good to have you here. How was your weekend? <laughs> you say, ah. Was it descansar? Warm? ¿Cómo se dice descansar en inglés? I rest, you say. Ah, rest. You okay. rest. I'm okay. rest. Are you rest on your weekend? That's very good. Let's see. What else did you do? Did you go out? Did you visit your family? What else did you do? I am not, not uh, outside, but Estadio Cuscatlan is close my heart. Oh, yes. And you had, a, you, had, yes. You, had, you had another game. Saturday <laughs> and, and Sunday. It was horrible. <sighs> no. It and was not outside. <laughs> you don't know. COVID. No, no. No. So you say it was crowded, crowded, and it was terrible. Crowded. What is the meaning of crowded is lleno, right? Ah. It was crowded, you say, when a lot of people together, right? Like the coasters in our country. Oh, okay. They are very Thanks. crowded. And you say mm. it was not terrific. It was terrible. Terrible. Okay. Ter terrific, it's good, right? Terrific is like, ah, terrific. No, uh -huh. but in this case, terrible. Terrible. It was okay. terrible, similar to hor horrible. Okay. Adela, how was your weekend? Uh, in my house. In my house. Good. I, I like your faces. Uh, like, how was it? Watch TV. <laughs> You watch TV, eh? Hey, that's watch cool. Watch TV with my dog, dog, hija. With my daughter, daughter. My daughter, my daughter and my dog. <laughs> and your dog, that's it, good. Grisia, how was your weekend? Um, Very tired and I'm rest. Very but, tired uh, and you rest. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. What about you, Jocelyn? How was your weekend? Uh, it was very good. It was very good. What about you, Mirna? How yes. was your weekend? Good. It was good with your family. Good. So, uh, what are the other students? Huh? Let's send a message in the chat that we're waiting for them. Okay. Lo vamos a mandar a traer ahí en el chat. ¿Dónde están? Le vamos a poner. Los estamos esperando. We are waiting for you. And they say the rain, teacher. The rain, nothing, nothing. Okay. fuerte, teacher. I know. Here. Yes. Yeah. File the internet. Yeah. They, it has been raining for more than an hour. Okay. So I am going to send them a message. We are waiting for you in class. Okay. There you go. Y un monito, le vamos a poner un monito. For them to be in the class, ok. Ya dejó de llover, no hay razón, le puede ser. <laughs> no, it is still raining, very hard. Ok, we are waiting for you in class. And, ok, an animalito, there you go. So, we are going to continue working today on uh, section number three, basically. Tell me, did you have the opportunity to advance in the platform? ¿Han tenido oportunidad de avanzar en la plataforma? Yes. Okay. okay. Ya tendríamos que haber terminado los exámenes de midterm. Ya los terminaron. I'm finished all. Everything on the platform. Yes. All the sections. Yes. Excellent. Very good. Adela, in which section are you? 
No, and section four. Okay, very good. Crisia? Section four. Excellent. Jocelyn? I'm doing section four. Excellent. Mirna? Okay, fantastic. Very good. Very good, very good, very good. Today, we are going to go over a little bit on professions and occupations. And if you finish section three, now you know what I am talking about. Ah. Just uh, a quick reminder, practice your English as much as possible. Ask for help whenever you need. Keep your cameras on. Attend your sessions on time. Participate as much as possible. Keep a cooperative attitude during class. And for sure, collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. So those are some of the agreements of our classes. In the previous class, we were talking about the use of there is and there are. Do you remember? Yes. Yes. Can you give me one example of a sentence with there is? There is a bed. There is a bed where? In my bedroom. In my bedroom, right? There is a bed in my bedroom. Okay, let's see. Uh, here you go. The next one. Who can give me another example? With there is or there are? There are chairs, uh-huh. In the kitchen, good. There are chairs in the kitchen. Good, another example. There are pictures in the living room. There are pictures in the living room, good. The next one. Give me an example with there aren't. There aren't any chairs in the living room. There aren't any chairs in the living room. Good. Give me another example with there isn't. There isn't a There isn't a chair in the living room. Good, good. Let me see. Adela, give me one example with there aren't. There are a chair, any chair? See there, there aren't any chairs, right? There aren't any chairs. Any chairs? Um, there aren't any chairs in the bedroom. Good, very good. So this is what we were talking about in the previous class. Let me just finish one example. Okay, today we're going to finish, to finish, to start working with professions and occupations. And in this case, I am going to ask you, what is your profession? What is your occupation? Mm -hmm. what is your profession or what is your occupation my occupation is teacher what is your occupation i am accountant i am an accountant good an accountant an accountant yes okay what i am uh, uh -huh. an uh, agronomist you are an agronomist. Hey, that's very good, very good. What is your profession or what is your occupation? I am accountant, an accountant. You are an accountant, an accountant. accountant. Good, very good. An accountant. Very good, let me see. Mirna, what is your profession and your occupation? Sorry? Yeah. 
I cannot listen to you, Mirna. I don't know why. Maybe it's a problem with your microphone. O quizás está muy lejos del micrófono. No. I, I am. Ajá. Administration assistant. Ah, administrative assistant, right? I am an administrative assistant. Good, very good. Excellent. Let me see. Let me see, let me see. Okay, so we're basically it, right? Crisia, you told me that you are? Sorry, I don't what listen. Is, what is your profession? Accountant. Accountant, right? Accountant, exactly <laughs> Accountant. as... Okay, Wendy, you are an accountant too, right? Okay, you see, we have the accountants here. Yes. Good, mm -hmm. very good. And Adela, you told me that you were? Can you see contract and facturation? Okay, you are, you are like mostly in, um, in the processes, payments. In payments, uh, in pagos y facturaciones. Okay, so that it's payments. Good, very good. So, and I am a teacher. Paola, hello, welcome to the class. Paola is right there, appearing in the class. It's very good to have you here. So, we have many different jobs. Right, we have many different jobs. Teacher, how are you? Hello, hello. It's good to have you here. We are talking about professions and occupations. What is your profession? I am a accountant. You are an accountant, another accountant. Oh my God, we have three accountants here. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's good. Yo hice accounting, pero en bachillerato nada más. <laughs> and then I discovered that I was going to be a teacher in my life. Okay, so I send you a message for all the other friends that are not here. We're waiting for you in class, okay? I made a big mistake before because I sent it to an incorrect group. <laughs> but now you have the message in the group for the rest of our friends. So here in the different professions and occupations, we have some examples. And in this case, we have the first one, cashier. Do you know what's the meaning of cashier? Cajera. Cajera, right? The one that it's at the supermarket. Beep, 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 beep. That's a cashier, right? The next one, what does it say? Cook. Cook or no, chef. chef, right? Cook or chef. What is that, right? A cook or a chef is the same thing, right? The next one is? Doctor. 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 Now with the pandemic and everything, hmm, that was a very difficult job. Flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight. It's the one that it's on the airplanes, right? Okay. <laughs> Good. The next one is? Judge. Judge. Judge, judge is judge. Juez. juez. The next one is? Lawyer. Lawyer, right? Lawyer. 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 This Lawyer. means abogado. abogado. Okay. Lawyer. Musician. 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 The next one is? Nurse. Nurse. Nurse, right? Nurse. 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 The next one we have? Pilot. 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 Okay. This is not pilot. pilot. This is not pilot. This is pilot. pilot. Okay. Pilot. pilot, que era un error del español que cometen muchos que dicen, hey, pásame un pilot. No, se llaman marcadores, plumones. Okay. It's not pilot. Okay. Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. The next one? Receptionist. 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 Sales Salesperson. Person. 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 This one that we have here is a receptionist. Okay. This one is a receptionist. The next one we have security guard. guard. Security guard. Security guard. 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 The next one, singer. 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 Waiter. 
Waiter. Waiter. Mesero. Mesero. Right? And waitress. Mesera. Waitress. Mesera. Okay. Waitress. Waitress. So let's go and practice here. We have cashier. 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 Cook. 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 Chef. 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 Doctor. 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 Flight attendant. Flight, Flight attendant. attendant. Flight attendant. Flight, Flight attendant. attendant. Judge. 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 Lawyer. 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 Musician. Musician. Yes. Nurse. 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 Pilot. 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 Police officer. Police, Police officer. officer. Receptionist. Receptionist. Salesperson. 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 Security guard. 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 Singer. 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 Waiter. Waiter. Waitress. 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 Okay. Now, in the next picture that we have here, what is her profession? Nurse. A nurse. Mm, what about no, doctor. Doctor. She's doctor. doctor? She's a doctor, right? She is she a doctor. Is a doctor. Mm. What about the next one? She is a, she's a, a nurse. nurse. She is a nurse, right? Remember to give me complete sentences because in this case, we give complete information. Let's see the next ones. I have here other pictures. What are the professions of the people in the pictures? What about this one? He is a pilot. He's a pilot. He's a pilot. She? She's, oh, a she's a flight attendant. Oh, yeah. Good. What about this one? He's a, a musician. musician. He is a musician, right? He is a musician. What about this one? She, she's, she's a singer. singer. She's a singer. Good. She's a singer. What about number eight? She's a judge. She is a judge, right? She is a judge. Number nine. He's, He's a, a police, police officer. He's a police officer. Good. Officer. What about number ten? A He's a lawyer. A lawyer. He's, He's a, lawyer. a lawyer, right? He's a lawyer. Don't tell me he's a liar, okay? He's a lawyer. A lawyer. A lawyer. But a liar, Pinocho, right? But this one, lawyer. Lawyer. What about number eleven? He's a cook. He is a cook. cook. cook or chef. He's a cook or a chef, right? Good, very good. What about number 12? He's, he's a waiter. 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 But he's right. a waiter, right? He's a waiter. waiter. And what about the lady? She's, she's a, waitress. a waitress. A waitress. Very good. What about number 14? He's a solid. They are a solid man. Salesperson. Okay, you can person say salesperson or salesman. You can say salesperson. Salesperson. Okay. If you tell me salesman, it's okay because you know that it's a boy. And if you tell me a saleswoman, it's okay because you know that she's a lady. Okay. What about the next one here? She is a cashier. She is a cashier, right? She is a cashier. And what about the one here? She is a police guard. Uh huh. She is a police officer. No, she is a security security guard. Security uh, guard. Security guard. Right. She's police, a security police. guard. The other is police. Officer. Police officer. officer. Thank you. Yeah, a police officer. Police officer and security, security guard. guard. What um, is the difference? What is the difference? It's the, a security guard. It's a private. private. Exactly right. And the security guard, it's in only one place, right? It's only in one place, just all day there. And the police officer, he's in all the country, in all the cities, in all the different places, right? That's the difference. The police officer, it's on the streets. And the security guard, in one place. 
Okay, let's continue here. Let me erase my pictures. People who work in a hospital. What other examples do you have? The doctor, the nurse? Patient. The patient, no, who work. Cashier. The cashier, good. Oh, you, Security you, you. guard. The cashier. Security guard. The security guard, right. Who else? Pilot. The what? Chef. A chef in a hospital? Yes, in some yes. of the cases they do. But what about this one? The janitor. Do you know what's the meaning of janitor? Janitor. Janitor, no. Ordenanza. Re receptionist. A receptionist also works in the in the in the hospital, right? The receptionist. What about in an office? Accountant. Accountant. Secretary. Secretary. The accountant works in an office, right? The secretary. Who else? Secretary. A security guard. The security guard and the receptionist. Boss. And the boss, right, for sure. The boss and the managers. In a store, who works in a store? En una tienda. Cashier. The cashier. Cashier. Salesman or saleswoman. The salespeople. Uh -huh. Salesperson. Security guard. The security guard. Uh huh. Who else? Security guard. A boss. The boss. Uh -huh. Janitor. I... The janitor. The pronunciation. Janitor. 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 The janitor. Uh -huh. Okay. And who works in a hotel? Who? Receptionist. The receptionist. Cook or chef. Okay, receptionist. Cook or chef. The cook. Uh huh. Waitress. The waitress. Singer. The singers, right? In some cases, they work in the hotels. Uh huh. Manager. The managers, right? So these type of people work in this uh, in these places, and also for this one, we have the maid. What is the maid? The maid are the mucamas. Las que trabajan ordenando todo, right? Those are the maids. Tell me one example, one example of a person who wears a uniform. Uh, police officer. The police officer, good. Police officer. Nurse. The nurse. Who else wears a uniform? The cook or the chef? The Coaches. cook or the chef. Good. Very cashier. Good. The cashier. Waitress. The waitress. Give me secretary. the secretary wears a uniform. Give me examples of people who stands all day. Están paraditos todo el día. Stands all guard. day. The yeah, security the guard. Nurse. No, the nurse, nurse person. the salesperson, janitor, the janitor, good. And janitor on the contrary, guard. on the contrary, a person who sits all day. A clown, <laughs> boss. The, hey, hey, hey. Ting, ting, ting. Yes, the boss, the receptionist, the receptionist. The secretary, accountant, the accountant, they have to be sitting all day. Oh my God. Yes. Give me example of people who handles money. Cashier. cashier. The cashier. Yeah. Give me another example of someone who talks to people. The sales people. <laughs> Teacher. The teacher. We the talk teacher. to people. We talk to people a lot. Waitress. The receptionist, the waitress, the call center, the call center agent. Call center agent. It talks 
to people. Dalton the security or... guard. Which one? Nerd. The nurse, right? Doctor. The doctor. Good, very good. What about people who work at night? The teacher. Fingers. <laughs> you. Fingers. The nurse. The, Lord, the, the police nurse. officer. The accountant. The police officer. The accountant. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Ahí la vimos el otro día trabajando en la oficina. Las cosas. Yes. Doctor. Yeah. The doctor. Right. And we have many other professions that we are not going to mention. The next one. Uh, who works hard? All the jobs. Right, all the professions work hard, right? The doctor. The doctor. Okay, imagine the farmers, the agronomers. My God, they work really hard. A person who writes tickets. ¿Quién da multas? ¿Quién police escribe multas? officer. The police, police officer. officer. The police officer, right? They give you tickets. So, talking about these uh, professions and these activities tell me one activity that you do in your job for example me i am a teacher so i talk to people all the time what is one activity that you do every day so think on one activity that you do every day in your job. Uh -huh. And if you don't know, you can tell me, teacher, how do you say? I am a cop. Um. Uh -huh. Bless you, Jocelyn. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Ok, bless you means salud. Ok, cuando ustedes estornudan a alguien, alguien le dice bless you. Ok, that means salud. Ok, Wendy, give me one activity that you do in your job every day. I am accountant. I am typing all the time. Ok, I type all the time. Good. Paola, oh. give me one thing that you do every day in your job. Sit all day. You sit all day. Okay, Mirna. Yes. I imagine. Mirna, what is one activity that you do in your job every day? Uh, every day, uh, talking uh, phone. Uh -huh. talking phone. You talk on the phone every yes. single day. Okay. Jocelyn, give me one activity that you do every single day. I talk with people and I visit, visit them. You visit places? Yes. That's very good. That's very nice. Let's see. Crisia, give me one activity that you do every single day. I call the customers all the day. You call the customers. It's like, hola, buenos días. Saluda, Crisia, ¿qué tal? <laughs> and then yes. you do it every single day. Adela, one activity that you do every single day? Okay, no me acuerdo cómo me dijo de facturación. <laughs> okay, you say, I, well, in this case, um, I write, and what is that? What is the name? the name of things? I check bills, you say. I check bills. Yes. Okay. I check bills, um, talking to the clients. To the clients, right? So I am going to send it to you on the chat. I check bills and I talk to the clients, right? You talk to the clients or to the customers in this case. So those are activities that you do every single day according to the profession that you have. Now, here I have a little example, right? Here you have a little conversation and it goes like this. Let's pay attention. It says, where does your brother work? In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. What is a front desk agent? 
es el encargado de recepción. Es el primero que encuentran en un hotel. He's a front desk agent. How does he like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. Hmm, that's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The plaza. Hey, that's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, that's interesting. And what does he do? Actually, he's the manager. <laughs> it's like, okay. Um, oops. I see, oops. Oops. <laughs> right? Uh, okay. It's very nice. <laughs> no, it's, a, it's another manager, the one that I don't like. Yeah, it's yes. not this one. It's another manager. <laughs> okay. It's like, no, no, no. Es que no, no es el manager Chelito. Es el morenito. No, mi hermano es el morenito. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay. So all of you are Angela and I'm going to be Rachel. Okay. Where does your brother work? In a hotel. In a hotel. Oh, really? My brother works in a hotel too. He's a front desk agent. How, How does, does he, like, he like, it? like it? Not very much. He doesn't like the manager. That's, That's too bad. bad. Yeah. What hotel what does he, he work for? The Plaza. That's, That's funny. funny. My brother, My brother works there too. too. Oh, that's interesting. What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. Oh, okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> and, then you, and then you just escape, right? Because, okay, you know, right? Now you start and I'm going to be Angela, okay? One, two, three, go. Where does your brother, 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 brother In a hotel. Oh, oh really? really? My, My brother How does he like it? That's too bad. What hotel does he work for? The the plaza. Plaza. That's funny. My brother works there too. Oh, oh that's interesting. That's interesting. That's interesting. What does he do? What does he do? Actually, he's the manager. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Great job, girls. Great job. Now, in the sentences, for example, when you say, eh, how does he like it? How does he like it? It means, eh, y le gusta, lo disfruta, right? Yes or no? And it's like, yes, uh, not very much. Or yes, he loves it. Yes, he likes it, right? In this case, he doesn't like the job very much. So how does he like it? Eh, not very much. He doesn't like the manager. So maybe he doesn't enjoy his job. And the different questions that we have here, where does your brother work, right? You have here where, that it's the place, does the auxiliary, your brother, that it's the subject and the verb, work. Another question that we have, what hotel does he work for? Okay, how does he like it? That is another form of question, right? And the last question that we have, what does he do? ¿Qué hace? What does he do? What does he do? Por eso fue la primera pregunta que les hice. Where do you work? What do you do? And you were telling me, I am an accountant, I am an agronomist, I am this and that, right? What does he do means, ¿qué profesión tiene? O ¿qué es lo que hace? Right? What does he do? And in here, I am going to continue and I'm going to go over the grammar for this, right? These are simple present WH questions. And in the sentences that I was explaining you, where do you work? ¿Qué lugar? ¿En dónde trabajas? What do you do? ¿Qué es lo que haces? And how do you like it? ¿Te gusta o no te gusta? This is for the first person for you, right? If you are going to ask another person, right? He, she, or it, you say, where does he work? What does he do? And how does he like it? This is for he or she, okay? And if we go to ask other people in plural, where do they work? What do they do? How do they like it? Okay, so that is, those are the three forms. When you ask about you, when you ask about he or she, 
And when you ask about other people. If I say, for example, right? Wendy, Wendy told me that she is an accountant, right? Yes. Yes. So Wendy is an accountant. If I ask the question, what does Wendy do? What will be your answer? What does Wendy do? ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? She does accountant. She is? She is she, accountant. She is accountant. accountant. Ajá. Pero si accountant comienza con vocal. An accountant. Right? She is an, an accountant. accountant. Right? And if I ask you about Jocelyn, what does she do? I don't remember. You don't remember about Jocelyn? Come on. Ah, so what is the question? Si no nos acordamos, ¿qué pregunta le haríamos? What? What, what she? What, what, what she does? does? Si le vamos a hacer la pregunta en primera persona. What do you do? What, what do, do you do? do? Right? What, what do, do you do, do, Jocelyn? I am an agronomist. Ah, she's an agronomist. Okay. Uh -huh. So, <clears throat> what does Jocelyn do? She's, a, she's, she's an, an agronomist. agronomist. She's an agronomist. agronomist. Good, very good. What about Paola? What does she do? Uh -huh. she's, an, she's an accountant. She's an accountant, yes. right? She's yes. an accountant. And you have it here, right? She's an accountant. Mm -hmm. Now, if I ask you about Wendy, Paola, and Will Adela, and Crisia, what do they do? They is an accountant. They, they are, are an accountant. They are accountant. Okay, ajá. They are accountants. Porque si ya las, ya las tenemos en plural, no vamos a decir an accountant, sino que aquí hacemos la profesión en plural. They are accountants. accountants. Imagínense que todos nosotros fuéramos docentes, todos fuéramos teachers. You say, what do they do? They are teachers. But yes, if it's teachers. only one, you say, what does teacher Nati do? She is a teacher. Teacher. Okay. So that is the main form of this, right? In this case, right, if it is in plural, you don't use a or an anymore. Okay. Usamos a and an si solo hablamos de singulares. Okay. She is a manager. She, he is a doctor. Okay. This is something for you to keep in mind. Okay. Now, here I have some example sentences and let's work on this one. For the questions, for the questions, when you mention the questions, we need to reduce a little bit on the pronunciation. You don't say, where do you work? You say, where do you work? Right? And it's one Where thing. Work. Where do you work? What do you do? Where does he work? And in this one, okay. I am going to silent everybody for you to listen to the pronunciation. Where do you work? What do you do? Where does he work? What does he do? Where do they work? What do they do? What do they do? Right, you go and you join the sounds for you to sound a little bit more fluent, right? Where do you work? It's one sound. What do you do? Where does he work? What does she do? Where do they work? What do they do? Okay, ahí para mejorar un poquito su fluency, la podemos reducir un poquito en la pronunciación. Practice with me. Where do you work? Where do you work? What do you do? What do you do? What, where does he work? Where does he work? What does she do? What does she do? Where do they work? 
What do they do? What do they do? What do they do? What do they do? Okay, so that is a form for you to reduce the pronunciation. Now, I have here a little example of the sentences that we have been practicing. And we are going to complete the sentences with the correct information. In here we have, what does your sister do? My sister, she's a nurse. And how are you going to complete this one? And it says, it's difficult, but she loves it. What question do you think we need here? How, how, how does she like? How does she like it, right? How does she like it? How does she like, like it? it? It's difficult, but she loves it. She loves it. What about the next one? And in this one, it says, at the airport. Where? Where, where does your where brother does you... Where does your brother work. work? Work. Where does your brother work? At the airport. He's a pilot. Oh. He doesn't really like it. It says how how does how? he how does he how does he how does he like it? How does like he like it? He doesn't really like it. What about the next one? Oh, I guess they like them. Who your parents? How how do your parents like their jobs? Excellent. How do your parents like, like. their jobs? Oh, I guess they like I them. I don't remember. Where? Where do they work? In an office in the city, right? In this case, it's where? like where? Where, where where do they work? Where do they work? In an office in the city. What about the last one? I am a student. What do you do? What, what do, do you do? do? Very good. What do you do? do? I am a student. I see. They are good. I like them a lot. It says. How do you like your class? How do you like your classes? How do you like your classes? They are good. I like them a lot. A lot of. I like them a lot. Porque aunque se nos inunde la teacher, ahí está en clase. Say, how do you like your classes? They are good. I like them a lot. Okay, I am going to go in the first conversation with Mirna. Okay. I am going to go in the first conversation with Mirna. Mirna, what does your sister do? My sister? You say. The microphone, honey. What does your Don't sister worry. do? Don't worry. My sister, she is a nurse. How does she like it? It's a difficult but she loves it. She loves it. It's difficult, but she loves it. Okay. Now, Mirna, what is the next person that's going to participate? Um, Wendy. Wendy, okay. <clears throat> Wendy, where does your brother work? At the airport. He's a pilot. Oh, how does he like it? He doesn't really like it. Okay, very good. Who is the next person, Wendy? Um, Adela? Adela, go ahead. Adela, how do your parents like their jobs? Oh, I guess they like them. I don't remember. Where do they work? In my offices in the city. Very good job. Adela, who is the next one? Um, Mirna? No, Mirna already passed. Another person. Paola. Paola, go ahead. <clears throat> Paola, what do you do? I am a student. I see. How do you like your classes? 
They're good. I like things a lot. Oke, okay, very good. Crisia and Jocelyn, conversation one. What does your What sister do? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, you. you. What does your sister do? My sister, she's a nurse. How does she like it? It's difficult, but she loves it. Very good job, very good job. Now, Paola and Mirna, conversation two. Okay. Where does your brother work? <laughs> the microphone, Mirna. <laughs> At the airport, he's a pilot. Oh, how does he like it? He doesn't really like it. Very good job, very good job. Now, okay, Adela and Wendy. Conversation three. Parents like hear jokes. Oh, I guess they like them. I don't remember where do you they work. In an office in the city. Very good job. Excellent job, my dear students. Now, here I have a compilation of different adjectives that you can use in order to describe jobs, right? How do you describe jobs? In this case, I have here some adjectives. For example, the first one that I have here, it's dangerous. Uh, can you well, mention can you mention a job that you consider dangerous? Bombero, fire work. Um, the fireman. I am going to send Some it burning. in the chat. The fireman. Police officer. The police officer. Good. What else? The cook, the chef. The cook or the <laughs> chef, right? Imagine. Ah, they cut their hand cooking or something. Good, the cook or the chef. Excellent. Security guard. The security guard, it's another dangerous job, right? Because we never know, right? And anything can happen. What about a job that you consider interesting? Teacher. Astronomy. A teacher's job. Yeah, it's interesting. Yes. An astronomer. Good, because you have to be talking about the the sky and the universe and, and everything, the, the, the stars and all that, right? What is a job that you consider stressful? Accountant. 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 <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, accountant. Mostly when you are looking for one cent, right? And it's like, where is it? Donde se metió ese centavo, right? <laughs> the stressful <laughs> job. What is a job that you consider well paid? A chef. A chef. That's good. A doctor. Uh huh. Bien engineer. pagado. An engineer. Good. An engineer. A teacher. One? <laughs> ah, sí. I, I love my job. I love my job. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. A nurse? No, I think no. nurses are no. not well paid. Judge. Ah, a judge. Pilot. A judge? Yes. A pilot? Yes. Yeah. Los, uh, los, attendant. los teachers ganamos experiencia y amor. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the only thing. Yeah, con todo su amor me, me basta. <laughs> <laughs> no tanto. <man. laughs> yeah, ahí, ahí, llego, ahí llego a Clesa y le digo, le voy a pagar con todo este amor. <laughs> no, but it, it, it's good. It's well paid. It's rewarding, right? It's rewarding. And that it's the best part, right? It's rewarding. What about an exciting job? What is a job that you consider exciting? The sink. The musician. The singers, the musicians, good. The what? pilot. The pilot, right? Yeah, it's exciting. Yeah, vamos cayendo, yay! <laughs> <laughs> it's exciting, wee! <laughs> no, 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 no. That, that's an exciting job, good. Yeah, a job that you consider difficult. The teacher. The teacher. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah. No, I, yeah, yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult. Yeah, I have uh, to accept. It's difficult. A job that you consider challenging, retador. Challenging. Challenging. The leones. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> okay, good. The, the cook or chef? The cook or the chef, right? A zookeeper, that's a challenging job, right? A zookeeper. Keeper. It's the one that, that takes care of the animals in the in the zoo, right? A singer. A singer. It's challenging. Good. Rewarding. A challenging job. A salesperson too. It's good. What about rewarding? I, I don't. Uh, que te retribuye mucho. For example, I like my job because I feel that I am helping you with the things that you need, right? Because you need to learn English and I am teaching you that because I, I, I know that. So I think it's rewarding, right? Any it, work. <laughs> yes, any work is rewarding, definitely. Yes, because many people ask me, Hey, pero Nati, pero ¿quién va a querer estar en clases a las nueve de la noche? And I said, una persona que quiere aprender, que se quiere seguir superando. And that's rewarding. So that's really nice for me. Because you do it, because you want to do it. And that's pretty awesome. Demanding. All the jobs are demanding. Right? Because you need to do things fast. And it's like, okay, okay, okay. I need this for yesterday, they say. And it's demanding. A lonely job, solitario. Accountant. An accountant, yes. right? Right, the accountant. Hello. It's me. <laughs> right, and you are alone there. <laughs> Repetitive, I am sorry that I have to say the accountant. Yes. Right, because you do yes. the same, the same, the same, the same, the same every single day. Right. Imagine, Perfect. imagine the yeah the receptionist. Right. Good morning, English corporativo. How can I help you? Good morning, English corporativo. How can I help you? Good morning. <laughs> it's repetitive and it is mechanical, mechanical. at the same time because you know okay. what you are going to say. Right. A job that you consider important. Todos. All of them are important. Right. All of them. Every single job is necessary. And it is important because if not, ¿qué pasa en la oficina cuando no llega el, el janitor? Todos andan, ay, pero llegué a eh, una escoba, que no sé qué, el basurero, que aquí, que allá. And you see that the job is important. What happens in a job on which you don't have the person in charge of the cafeteria? ¿Qué pasa cuando no llega la del cafetín? You are like, no, I, I am hungry. I want to eat something, okay? And so, you want coffee. And you want coffee, right? All the jobs are important. Practical. That's all. Uh -huh. all. All of them. If you need, if you master them, it's easy. Convenient. If you live close to your office, convenient. that's convenient. Lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> Politicians, you say? Yes. Yes. <laughs> eh, buen punto. <laughs> yeah. And fantastic. If you have a job, that's fantastic, right? <laughs> Definitely. Definitely. A fantastic job, any job that you have that it's legal. And good and correct, that's fantastic, okay? Repeat with me. Dangerous. 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 Interesting. 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 Stressful. 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 Well paid. Well paid. Well paid. Exciting. 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 Difficult. 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 Challenging. 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 Rewarding. Rewarding. Demanding. 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 Lonely. 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 Repetitive. 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 Mechanical. 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 Important. 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 Practical. 
practical. Convenient. Convenient. Fantastic. 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 So, how do you use the adjectives in order to describe the jobs? You use them like this, right? You say, a firefighter's job is dangerous. You can have the verb to be first and then the adjective. Okay, podemos tener primero el verbo to be y después el adjetivo, right? A firefighter's job is dangerous. dangerous. Y si aquí se fijan, tenemos un posesivo, okay? A firefighter's job is dangerous. El trabajo de un bombero es peligroso, right? Dangerous. A doctor's job is stressful, right? Or if you want to have a complete sentence, you say, a firefighter has a dangerous job. A doctor has a stressful job. Okay, so that is the two forms that we can have. Now, I need you to create another example, use this form. Give me another example using the first form, usando la primera fórmula. Uh, uh, nurses is a nurse's job is stressful. A nurse's job is stressful. Stressful. Okay. Give me another example. Uh, With another profession and another adjective. A police officer's job is dangerous. A police officer's job is dangerous. Very good. Another example. A pilot a pilot is exciting. A pilot's job, and let me just move it here. A pilot's job is exciting. Good. Now, I need you to transform the sentences into the other form. A nurse has a stressful job. A has a stressful job. A stressful job. Good. What about the next one? Officer. Uh, Sorry. Officer. Officer. Has, Officer. has a dangerous job. Officer. Officer, Officer. right? Officer. I say a police. Officer. A police. Perdón, ahí que se me fue la Officer has a dangerous job. A dangerous job. Right? A police officer has a dangerous job. What about the next one? A pilot. A pilot. Okay. Let me hear. Let me write it here. A pilot has. A pilot exciting. has yeah. an exciting, exciting. Job. exciting job. Okay. An accountant has a stressful, stressful job. A stressful, a stressful job. job. An agronomist has interesting, interesting, interesting an job. interesting job. job. A teacher has <laughs> Silence. An easy, <laughs> easy job. An easy job, they say, okay? An easy <laughs> job. Yes. It's an easy job. It's an easy job. It's fantastic. But if you do it for a long time, yeah, the first days are like terrible. But then with the practices, yeah, it's easy, right? Yeah. <laughs> Solo me ha tomado como 18 años decir que es fácil. <laughs> And it, no, and I continue considering a challenging job. I think a teacher's job is challenging <laughs> because you need to be constantly learning. Tienes que seguir aprendiendo cada día. Yo creo que el día que un docente deja de aprender, ahí pierde el derecho de seguir enseñando. So you have to continue learning every single day, every single day, something new because it's difficult. So those are the two forms. You can have it with the verb to be and the adjective, or you can have the adjective and the noun. 
Sorry? Sally con eh, Luis. <laughs> we were in the middle of the chamber with Paola. Come on, I'm, I'm sorry. And I was like, ¿Qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? <laughs> sorry, sorry, Paola. I, I thought that you were talking to me. Okay, so we have here the last example of the night. And it says, a, music, a musician's job is interesting. If you transform the sentence, it says, a musician has an interesting job. What about the next one? And this is for Wendy. An athlete's job is exciting. Transformémosla la otra forma. An athlete he has a exciting job. Ajá, pero si tenemos exciting con vocal al principio. An exciting. Very job. good job. What about Adela? A lawyer's job is stressful. A lawyer has um, it's a, it's stressful. Uh -huh. stressful. A lawyer has a stressful, a stressful job. 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 Very good. Mirna, a security guard, has a boring job. This is the other form. Uh, is a job boring. Ok, en esta lo tenemos al revés, tenemos la otra fórmula. ¿Cómo la pasaríamos a la fórmula que tenemos aquí? Uh, a security score job is boring. Very a security score job jobs a boring job. Jokes okay. Are boring. Okay, no nos confundamos. Tan, tan, tan. So you say, sí. a security, security guard job yeah. is, is boring. boring. Right? A security guard's job Bar is, boring. is boring. What about the next one? We're going to go with Paola. Let's do number five in this form. Yes. Uh, to graphics job is, uh, is a difficult job. Ok, ok. Aquí ya no vamos a repetir. Eh, la vamos a hacer aquí arriba, ok. A photographer's job. A photographer's job. Is difficult. Yes, that we leave it, right? It's difficult. Um, okay, a photographer's job is difficult. difficult. Let's do the last one, Jocelyn. A police officer is uh, dangerous. Dangerous. Mm, no. How do you transform this one? A police officer's job is dangerous. dangerous. Excellent job, right? A police officer's job is dangerous. dangerous, okay? I am going to bring you another example of this one. Creo que para mañana le voy a preparar otro ejemplo de esto para que lo practiquemos, okay? Because it's complicated, I know, and it's difficult. Well, my dear students, I'm going to see you tomorrow for another class. Have a beautiful night and take care. Bye bye. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Thank you. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye. bye.